Hallo Leute und willkommen bei VW Ledergerät Kanal. Or for those of you that can't stomach my terrible German. Hello folks and welcome to the Volkswagen battery charger channel. Where, as you can see, we have a new addition to the family. It's kind of like big, bigger, biggest. Over here we have the small one. This is our Golf Hybrid charger, which we have pretty much got uh, fully working now. On top here is our, well, sorry, I should say the Volkswagen P have one is 3.3 kilowatts. Up top here of this sandwich is our Say At Me or Skoda City Go or VW E Up. 7.2 kilowatt charger which is currently fighting me and underneath that down here is the big one this is our audi e-tron 11 kilowatt charger all of these by the way made not that far from me at all here in good old ireland so hmm one down two to go uh, is where things are currently uh, looking. The Mi Charger, or the E-Up, or whatever you want to call it, is this guy here. This is the one that I've been uh, working on the last few days. I've taken a bit of a break from it because it has been... It hasn't been really... Um, hasn't been working out. Um, these particular chargers, okay, I guess I should do a bit of a boring explanation, first of all, just to make sure nobody bothers watching this garbage. So these chargers essentially operate in their two kind of modules. Some of them contain both modules, some of them have one of the modules externally. External. So this charger is the one we have pretty much working now, is our Golf p -Hev. And this one has obviously got the charger brains in there, but it's also got the charge manager brains in there. So what does the charge manager do? Well, the charge manager is the thing that communicates with our charging port. As you can see, we're now using a non-Volkswagen charging port, but I'll cover that in another video. Um, and it controls, you know, the locking and unlocking of the charging port, detecting how much current our control pilot gives us and all that kind of thing. And it then signals the charger part to commence charging and controls it, tells it how much current to send and when to throttle back and all that kind of thing. And that's all built into the actual box here, so we don't even need to think about it. But on the CAN bus, you can see that there's a separate, there's separate IDs for the two modules. Now our Mi charger does this differently because there is no charge manager in here. So instead of this big bunch of wires here that you see going in, there's literally only two CAN buses. This is the Mi plug I have here. It's literally just two, two CAN, so there's four can wires, uh, positive and a ground, that's it. Um, the charge manager module in the Mi is actually under, underneath one of the front seats, it's a completely different box. So I have got one of those on the way and hopefully we do some analyses of that guy, uh, we'll be able to figure out why our Mi charger is not being friendly. Now, moving on to this guy. This is the big guy from an Audi e-tron. This is 11 kilowatts, three phase. So if we look into that, probably won't really be able to see, but it's five uh, pins in the AC connector. Um, and this guy has got the charge manager 
built in. Now, how do I know that? Well, I've just done a quick can log of just powering up the charger on the bench here, and I can see the two sets of IDs. And also, when we look at the pinout uh, from the Audi Tech Info website, we can see that it's got all the charge port stuff connected here. But that's not all, folks, because why, you know, why have a boring charging port when you can have a sexy charging port like this one? And who wants to communicate over, you know, boring 12 volt signals when we can have Linbus? Yes. Folks, I welcome you to, yeah, this thing. This is not a charging port. This is a charging port door. So what, back in the day, we just pushed it in, it just popped out. Now, no, 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 no. Now we've got ourselves some 3D CAD designed, a nightmare of a thing with more sensors and actuators and plastic clips and wires and everything just waiting to get broken off. So, speaking of things getting broken off, I purchased this one on the old eBay pretty cheaply because guess what? Someone had to replace it because guess what? This little sensor here, little plastic clip on top of it, broke off. And this little sensor on the side here also broke off. But that's okay. Because we just need this to work so we can grab the LIN communication and then hopefully be able to uh, send that LIN and have a LIN chat as well as a CAN chat with our 11 kilowatt Audi charger. So, uh, what we would really need again, and I'm always asking for this, I know, so I'm probably boring everyone to death, are some CAN logs. So if anyone has a Volkswagen E-Up and would like to do some CAN logs and or an Audi e-tron, then please do uh, get in touch. But, I think I've saved the best bit to last. See, most of these vehicles, with the exception of the plug-in hybrid, have DC fast charging. And it's CCS. Therefore, the charge manager has to have the CCS modem and all the CCS control fun packed stuff in there, like our trusty i3 limb. So, turns out that this thing not only will be an 11 kilowatt charger, but if we are 11 kilowatt AC charger, I should say, but with enough uh, of me banging my head against the wall on some can logs, we might just be able to get this thing to do CCS uh, DC fast charging for us as well. And even possibly the separate module that controls these um, 7.2 kilowatt variants. So folks, that's it. A quick little update, as quick as any of my videos ever are, on our Volkswagen charger situation. I would like to very much thank one of my patrons who very kindly donated this beast of a 11 kilowatt charger to me. Uh, just arrived today, so said I would make a little video on this just to uh, show you that. Yeah, the chargers are kind of taking over the workbench here at the minute, but hey, such is life. So, I'll leave it at that. As always, dislike thumbs down don't share don't subscribe don't check any of the links in the description don't support me on patreon or paypal because look at what i'm doing with your money it's crazy waste and until next time all i can say at this point is happy audi charger hacking